How does triangulation work? What is triangulation? You hear them use this word when they're trying to find the location of a cell phone or something like that. So we have a cell phone tower right here. And through fancy technology, we know that the cell phone is exactly 1.2 miles from here. Using just one tower, all we know is that the cell phone is somewhere around here. That's a lot of spaces for us to check. No one's going to find a cell phone in a big circle. We need to hone in onto where it is. So we'll use a second cell phone tower. And now we know that it's, say, 2.4 miles from that tower. So now we know it's somewhere along this circle, but since we already knew it was somewhere along this circle, we've now narrowed it down to these two spots. That's pretty exciting. We know it's one of two spots. If we want to know the exact location, we want to find a third cell phone tower. Let's say there's a cell phone tower right here. Now, if we know the distance from that cell phone tower, let's say 1.8 miles, we can draw another circle for that tower. So now we know it's somewhere along this green circle, but the only point that all three circles will give us is that point right there. So now we found the cell phone. And the reason it's called triangulation is because these three towers are the vertices of a triangle. And that is how triangulation works.